Sarah Winchester. His mind is as chaotic as the house itself. We're worried about her sanity, Dr. Price. Mrs. Winchester, it's a pleasure to finally meet you. I had not been familiar with the house at all. And so uh, when I started researching it and getting involved and discovering this, I'm from Texas. Like, we, like I, it, it, is, it is a big thing in Northern California. And for those, in, I guess, probably more familiar in the supernatural, people are more interested in the supernatural community. But I'd never heard of it before. And then to realize how important it was to so many people and how many people had memories of this place from their childhood. And, and you had mentioned the Winchester house to, and you'd just see people perk up and go, I've been there, I've been there. Uh, it, was, it, it was really encouraging and really exciting to, to get involved in it. Do you believe in ghosts, Dr. Price? I do not believe in anything I cannot see or study. I feel their presence in the air, in the wall. It has found us. To be honest, you have to take liberties with it because so much of it is a mystery, and which is what makes the house so fascinating, is because there are uh, so many questions with the house. There are so many questions with its history. There are so many questions. I mean, it's called the Winchester Mystery House. I mean, it's, uh, it is, it is uh, an appropriate name for that place because when you walk through it, you don't get a lot of answers. You just get questions. You just get tons of questions of why is that there? And, and why is that there? Why, why did she do this? Why was she doing this? So uh, there are no definitive answers. We lock them away. 13 nails seals them in. I will do whatever it takes to protect my family. The spirits have always done their own stuff. So to the best of my knowledge, this is the first time they took a script and um, directed someone else's script. And so then they did a lot of rewrites of their own and really kind of made it their own. It's, this is very much a spirit piece, you know, like um, I, I feel like I handed an assist to them to a, a you know, a Spirit Brothers film, you know, like I initiated it, handed it off to them and then they made it their own. So it was uh, definitely two phases. It was my phase, the initial phase, and then the Spirits came on, and then it was their phase, and they brought it home. Are white and dew drops are waiting for thee.